Warm greetings. My name is Sir Rodney Williams, Governor General of Antigua and Barbuda, and I am very pleased to join fellow UWI alumni, co-patron and president of Barbados, Her Excellency, the Most Honorable Dame Sandra Mason, in encouraging you to participate in our very first social mediathon event for a noteworthy cause. This online event seeks to bring to life the UWI Open Campus Endowment Fund, a positive initiative which emerged from the challenging circumstances occasioned by the COVID-19 pandemic. The negative impact of this infectious disease on our region and more specifically on the faculty, staff and students of our globally recognized regional tertiary education institution was palpable. COVID-19 descended upon us with little or no warning, rendered many unwell, jobless, penniless, and vulnerable to the vagaries of life. Our UWI saw and felt the anguish. We saw the pained expressions on the faces of those students who were in shock and awe with the sudden closure of the tourism and other visitor-dependent sectors. We heard the pleas for extra time to meet tuition and other payments. We saw the increased number of requests for deferrals with reasons such as unemployment, the death of the family breadwinner, ill health, and unmanageable stress. This level of trauma was not one where our UWI could just simply say sorry and move on, send a card and hope for the best. This required the Caribbean region's leading educational institution to do something to help its most vulnerable students. True to form, the framework was developed and it is now our turn as UWI alumni, corporate members, Caribbean citizens at home and abroad, regional residents and friends of UWI to respond in a way that matters. I call on all to give generously to achieve the goal of Barbados $1 million. This fund will provide relief for vulnerable students now and serve to provide a very important cushion against future shocks. I encourage you to give generously to the UWI Open Campus Endowment Fund. Join us on Saturday, July 30th from 6.30 p.m. so that together we can make a difference. Thank you very much.